Balake. Where is Balake at? My name's Blake. Blake? What? Do you want to go to war, Balake? I'm for real. A.A. Ron. A.A. Ron is present. Thank you for joining me, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. And I hope you'll forgive the mess while I continue to get moved into my new recording space and get the new pallet wall built and, uh, and all that good stuff. But what I want to share with you today is an amazing secret video recording of David Miscavige and Tom Cruise that was taken aboard Scientology's ship called the Free Winds, where Tom Cruise had um, a very expensive and uh, very private birthday party. This is a never before seen recording that Mark Headley published to his YouTube channel yesterday. I very much suggest that you go and subscribe to Mark Headley's YouTube channel. I'll put an image up here of what it looks like. Uh, the name of the channel is Blown For Good, and Mark has a treasure trove of videos and documents and things of this sort that he'll be publishing over there. So please check that out. So without any further ado, let's take a look. This video was one minute long. Let's take a look at this secret recording. Mark has it narrated and everything. It's fantastic. Here it is. So this is a video of Dave Miscavige and Tom Cruise that was taken right after Tom Cruise had a birthday party aboard the Scientology cruise ship, The Free Winds. And the person that recorded this video did it on a camera phone, which were very new at the time. This is back in 2004. And you can see that's why it's moving all around like that. But I'm pretty sure that Dave and Tom do not know they're being recorded. And I don't even actually know that the person recording the video did it on purpose. I cut these two clips together. But right here, it looks like Dave kind of notices the guy, which makes me think that he knew he was recording him. And then um, when he gets brave enough to put the camera back up, Dave points right at him, and that's when the recording ends. So who knows what happened here? Boom. Please like and subscribe. I'm new at this. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Thanks. <laughs> well, this video is not going to do any, it's not going to put to rest any of the rumors about there being some sort of a strangely inappropriate uh, relationship between Dave and Tom. I mean, in this part of the video where they're just standing there giggling like schoolgirls, uh, yeah, only going to throw some fire on those rumors. I mean, this isn't like a scandalous video leak or anything, but I can tell you that from Miscavige's perspective, the very fact that some Sea Org member took video recording of a private event with him and Tom Cruise, and it was never found out about until Mark Headley uh, published this to the internet. That is going to be a very big deal to David Miscavige. That would be a massive breach of security, even though, uh, e e even given how many years old this video recording is, that's not necessarily relevant. Miscavige will be trying to figure out who took this video, believe it or not. And the other thing I want to point out, get a load of how much shorter than Tom Cruise David Miscavige is. This is proof, all the proof anyone would ever need. He's a good half a head shorter than Tom Cruise is. And by the way, the reason why I troll Miscavige so often about his height is because he is so personally sensitive about that subject. And also I thought this was a perfect example of something that gets mentioned when people ask, will Tom Cruise ever leave Scientology? Is Tom Cruise staying in Scientology because they've got a bunch of blackmail on him? Uh, you know, things like that. Just take a look at the beginning of this video and, and just realize what it is that's happening here. I mean, this is a birthday party that was held on a private cruise ship just for Tom Cruise. An entire freaking cruise ship has been repurposed to be the venue for Tom Cruise's private birthday party put on by his best friend, the leader of the Scientology organization. And just look at the adoration that's being showered upon him and how he's just soaking it up. And every one of those little foot soldiers, those Sea Org foot soldiers, they know damn well they would be in a lot of trouble if they're the first ones to stop clapping. Very much like what I've heard stories, is it, is it North Korea or is it, um, uh, you know, 1930s Germany? I've heard stories of, you know, standing ovations that would just go on and on and on because, or was it even Soviet Russia um, under one of the czars? Uh, anyone who was found to be, uh, observed to be the first person to stop clapping would be hauled away to the gulag or something like that. Um, you know, 
<laughs> a private birthday party on a cruise ship for Tom Cruise isn't exactly comparable to the gulags, but uh, you know the analogy still applies. And, and and I guess what I'm saying here is this is the kind of treatment and adoration and special treatment that Tom Cruise gets in Scientology, and he's getting it from the leader of the the damn leader of the organization. Don't forget, David Miscavige has been the best man at all three of Tom Cruise's wedding. So, you know, things like this are not a one-off. This is why you hear stories of Scientology's um, own Sea Org members, the so-called clergy of Scientology being tasked with personally working uh, in Tom Cruise's like household staff and um, in his professional staff and, and almost working as a staffing agency for him. So, you know, if videos like this are any indication uh, there's no reason that we should expect to see Tom Cruise leaving Scientology anytime soon at all. And I think we can reasonably conclude it's not things like secret blackmail that keeps Tom in Scientology. It's this kind of special treatment and adoration and having an entire worldwide organization basically at his beck and call through the authority of his best friend, David Miscavige. So again, this is a special, uh, special exclusive from Mark Headley on the Blown for Good channel. Jump over there and subscribe because there's going to be a lot more uh, where that comes from. All right, everyone, that is all I have for now. Thank you for watching and listening. Thank you to everyone who watches until the very end, and I'll talk to you soon. Okay, if you want to see my rock and roll songs, click right on this guitar. And if you want to see a, a different one of my videos, uh, oh, yeah, then you could click right inside here. If you have subscribed or not, subscribe right here. Bye!